everybody. Welcome back. We're here at the last slide 10, and we're going to get into some Disney Infinity action now. Don't do a lot of Disney Infinity here on the Twitch channel, but if you go to our YouTube sister channel, which is All Night Gaming, which you can find very easily with the same title as this video, which is Disney Infinity Under Construction, you will find our channel over there, and there's a whole ton of Disney Infinity stuff if that is your game. I am hoping everything is going to be working the way I want it to right now because the PS4 I have out in the living room, of course, is not the same as the PS4 Pro that I more recently added. But there we go. Everything's back up and matching. So we're in the studio this time. We're going to do some work on the Rocket League build that I've done for Disney Infinity. We're going to do a couple of things with it. Um, before we get too deep into the woods, though, I'm going to have to make some space. So we're going to get rid of a couple of these that I've already combined. If you go to the Star Wars, let's see, Battle Station game, it has n nine of these all combined in it to make space so I can get rid of these. So I'm confident that this is fine. I can get rid of it. And if not, it's already backed up, so we're still safe. I will need that momentarily. And this is also in there. I'm just trying to remember what that one was. Yeah, okay. And realistically, we can get rid of this one as well. So that'll make some rate room that I'll need shortly here for this. All right, so when I built Rocket League, I did not own Rocket League. I'd seen some gameplay and things of that nature, but I'd never played the game. Somebody else had uh, in our community, which is Disney Infinity, or try to get Infinity Ever After on the PlayStation Network. So if you want to join the community, feel free to stop in there and say hello. We've got 200 fans that all helped me build that community after the servers went down. So these are people that really do love the game even after the servers. And they'll set up share plays and things like that. We keep the game alive over there. Anyway, that all said, I didn't know much about Rocket League. I knew the basics. I had not played the game. Now, since then, if you are familiar with this channel, I've played quite a bit of Rocket League. And it makes me realize we can do some more stuff with this build to make it more accurate to the actual Rocket League game. What I wanted to do was put a roof on it. And I'm still thinking that we can do that. I know how to do that. It might actually turn out better than I even imagined. But other stuff as well. I'm going to make a second version of this. Yep, my bad, sorry. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, a second version of this, and the second version is going to... What's it going to do? It's going to be for the car's characters. Therefore, you won't have this scenario popping up here. You'll just have two cars ready to go. The game will be ready to go. So if you want to use the characters from cars, which I thought would be super fun. But right now we're going to finish this one up. Then we'll just copy and paste and then make a few alterations for the cars version. Does that make sense? Well, I hope so, because that's what we're doing. All right, so let's pop out real quick, get into our spark mode. I'm a little rusty because it's been a few minutes. Now, the difference, of course, here is we have some square shapes. So if you're driving up and trying to curve walls and stuff like that, it's going to be tough with a square. So what I am thinking we do here... Let's get into our building blocks. Let's find our triangulars. And that's exactly what I was hoping would happen. I think that'll fit perfectly. Right there. Drop that down. Boom, like, no, not quite. Let's see. Well, even those don't fit flush, do they? Well, it's still better than nothing. All right, so we're gonna go here. And we're gonna get and give it the, uh, Probably with an attacher going backwards. Like I said, it's been a little bit, and I'm a little bit rusty, but we'll get it. It'll come back. It's like riding a bicycle, baby. Did I miss it? I still feel like it's faster going forwards. I'm drawing a 
blank on what the name of it is. I know it when I see it. Hologram. There it was. I did go past it. And that gives you your transparency. So we're going to set the theme so that all the blocks now have that. And here we go. So that'll give you a bit of a rounded edge. You'll be coming off of these hard walls here. And it'll kind of somewhat round. It's as round as we're going to get. Now there is something else I did kind of want to look into, but we'll do that in a minute. We'll probably do that first, really, because if it turns out to be a thing, I just don't think it will be. No, it won't hurt us to look. Um, somewhere here in the racing toys, I believe. Yeah, these are the guys I was thinking of. And the million dollar question, though, is... Yeah, these will not... those there. We just have to back the stadiums out, which is not a big deal. And are they stackable? They are. Hmm. And are they compliant with that? They are. stick with the blocks. And I'll tell you why. Um, I'm moving everything back, which is not a big deal. It'll take a little time, but nothing huge. You're going to leave this gap here, and it's, and there actually is a map in Rocket League where you kind of have an upper deck. Uh, I hate that map. <laughs> with this you really get a visual that lets you know as the other one will be completely invisible like the walls already are so this kind of helps give you a little bit of a uh, map as to where you're at Once again, if you've played the game, you know there are multiple different arenas with different features to them, and they even have the underwater one, and I'm like, well, we got that in Disney Infinity. Why are we not taking advantage of it?
All right, guys, that's going to wrap it up. Old school reminding you that when it comes to Disney Infinity, it is still the only game where the only limitation is your imagination. We'll catch you again next time when, once again, we are under construction. Until then, everybody have a wonderful day.